What's up guys, this is Tyler from Typhoon Gaming and welcome back to another Mario Maker video. Today I'm finally bringing you episode 1 of me playing your Christmas levels. I'm super excited to get these started, so let's get right into it. Alright guys, I've already gotten a lot of great submissions and they're still coming, so I will be playing these levels throughout this whole next week and hopefully releasing videos about every other day on average. Um, but if you're one of these three people right here, make sure you stick around because I'll be playing your levels in this episode. But let's get things started off with Nate. This one is called Bowser Claus is Coming to Town. It has a pretty low clear rate, but not many people have played it yet, so let's check it out. All right. Looks like we are climbing on snow. This is really cool. Oh, look at that. Get an extra life for my all of my hard work. And anything else over here? Guess I'll do just a little bit more exploring just in case I get like a mushroom or something. And Ooh, there's houses. Got some smoke coming out of the chimney. Very nice. Uh, maybe we'll check out the Goomba house. Oh! Well, now I want to check the other house. <laughs> oh man. Alright, so it looks like we can't go in there, so we will just go ahead and move on over here. And maybe Bowser Claws is somewhere around here. I like this tree, it looks awesome. And... All right, we can go down here. Part of me wants to have explored more in that, uh, oh, got some ruined houses. And Bowser's castle now. Uh-oh, I'm getting nervous. Hmm, do I try going in here? Oh, it's just showing the destroyed homes. Creepy. All right, in the door. Where is Bowser Claus? Oh, here he is. Oh, nice, with the reindeer. That looks awesome. <laughs> That's great. Oh, God. All right, this is gonna be a little bit tricky, but looks like it'll be a ton of fun, so hopefully... Oh, okay, so we have to wait on a... Oh, I got it. So there was a mushroom that we can get in the beginning. We can use the shells to kill off people. <laughs> and then we have to wait on a pow. God. This is creepy. Oh no. <laughs> All right, Bowser Claus, you're done for. Okay, doing decent. Oh, darn it. <laughs> Stupid buzzy beetles. I'm gonna take out the reindeer first, which I realize is horrible of me, but it kind of makes this part a little bit easier at least. All right, we got the reindeer out, so now we just have to dodge fire. Oh, and another mushroom, awesome. Give me that star. Hey! Come on, pal. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Awesome. That was such a cool boss battle. The, uh, it was very tight, uh, quarters and stuff, but... Oh, it looks like I missed out on, a uh, extra life up there. But yeah, it wasn't much room to work with. Oh, I love that. Typhoon. Gaming. Awesome ending. Oh, whoops. <laughs> the ice made me slip into... The lowest score possible. I should have climbed on top of gaming, but that's all right. Thank you so much, Nate, for submitting this level. I thought the boss battle was awesome and the decorations looked great. So go ahead and have a star, and we will move on to the next level. All right, guys, the next level we are taking a look at today comes from Levi, and this one is called Happy Hanukkah Comments On. So I did get a Hanukkah level which is awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and start this one up. All 
All right, here we go. In 167 BC, the Jews were being persecuted by the Greek king Antiochus. Something like that. Oh, and I like this menorah here. Oh, very cool effect. Looks awesome. One day the Greeks raided the holy temple, bringing in their idols and pigs. Dang, this is awesome. Oh, squeezing in there, awesome. In the door. They broke the high priest seal on all of the flasks of oil, turning all oil impure. Alright, in the door. This spawned a war between the many Greeks and the few Jews. The Jewish warriors called themselves Maccabees, a Hebrew acronym for who is like you among God's Lord. A quote from Exodus. This was on their shields. Alright, we'll kill the muncher and... Ooh, fight! Dang. This is awesome. Really good idea for a kind of boss battle. Oh gosh, and we have to dodge Bowser's <laughs> random fireballs too. Look at that skill. Oh, I just realized that the uh, mushrooms there get destroyed and then the red mushroom gets stuck up, up on top. It's really cool. All right, so let's do this fight again. No! I wasn't sure if I'd be able to hit that from there or not. Oh, darn it! The lava bubble screwed me up. Darn it! I wanted to get some fire flowers from the menorah. Dang. Alright, I guess I'll play fair. No! The star was so close! That cheese strat! That cheese strat! Yes! Oh yes, beautiful. Sorry, I had to do it. This is getting a little too hard. <laughs> In the door, look at that cheese strut. Oh god, can we do it? Can we do it? Let's just not get drilled by RNG fireballs. Checkpoint! Oh god. Ah! Fair enough, gotta shell jump my way out of here. Oh, that was almost it! But the uh, fire was coming from above anyways. There we go, finally! Oh boy, took me long enough. Killed Bowser. However, this wasn't the end of the war. You've defeated the Greeks and restored the temple. They searched and searched but couldn't find a flask with the high priest seal. Finally, they found one pure flask of oil, and this day's worth of oil miraculously lasted eight days until the they were able to get more. Awesome. Okay, so those have mushrooms in them. And we rise to the top. Light the menorah candle, bruh. 
in the holy temple. I will. Do I have to light all of them? Uh. Oh, thank you. This is fun. We get to light the candles. Nice. All right, so we got a whole bunch of keys. We lit all the candles. And now we have the menorah all lit up. We celebrate these miracles by lighting candelabras for eight nights on Hanukkah. Candelabras? I don't know how to say that. But anyway, and by eating chocolate candy and gold wrappers and by singing special praises and by reading the story of the dedication of the tabernacle from Numbers. Gotta get all them coins. Awesome. Thanks for playing. Well, thank you for submitting. And we get the one up. Awesome level. Thank you so much for submitting it, Levi. I like how you made it a story level and had a really couple of really cool boss battles in there as well. Very nice job. We'll go ahead and leave you a star and let's move on to the next level. All right, guys, the final level we are checking out today is called Colossal Christmas Tree. And I can't decide if that's a three or a face with big lips. But uh, I'll let you guys decide that one. But this comes from Anton. And it has a pretty high clear rate. So let's get right into it and check it out. Gee, oh man. I didn't even see the... Uh... I didn't even see the spikes, but this is cool. I like how... Oh man. Trying to navigate this is a little bit tricky, but we got a P-switch. There's all kinds of uh, coins and... Hmm. Does this just bring me to the other side? Awesome. So, we have coin collecting, we have all kinds of good stuff. Um, where am I gonna go first? I don't know if I need to take the P-Switch with me, so I'll just kind of throw that to the side for now. We have four of the five. Oh, and there's the last one. Let's try this door. All right, <laughs> not what I was expecting. Can I go in here? Oh, I bet I have to go in here. No? What comes out of there? <laughs> All right, feathers. Oh, there's uh, doors over to the right side. What did those doors do? Oh, maybe I had to get lucky uh, with the door I went in. We'll try to get the pink coins again to get the uh, to go in the right door this time. All right, got all the coins again. Which one is it? Let's try the right one. Hey, I think we got it. Awesome, awesome level. I love the decorations. Oh, and I love the heart too. What's in there? Nothing. Okay, fair enough. Oh, so that's where the other one would have dumped out if I had gone in that door. Really, really cool. I like how you spelled out Xmas at the end. We'll go ahead and finish the level. And thank you so much for submitting. I love how you used a ton of different items as ornaments on your giant tree. And then you had to guess the correct door to go in. Very cool stuff. And we got the new record. I'll go ahead and give you a star. And that is all that I have for you today on this episode of your Christmas levels. Make sure you leave those uh, Christmas levels in the comments of the Christmas level video or in the comments of this video by December 23rd. And then I'll be playing those levels in episodes throughout this week. And if there's too many to play through this week, then I'll play them a little bit after Christmas as well. But thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Feel free to leave a like and comment below, but until next time, I'm out.